How's it going YouTube? Tyler the Hotshot Hauler here. Gonna be showing you all how to properly lubricate a leaf spring uh, suspension, okay? Um, this video applies to basically anybody that has a leaf spring suspension on any type of trailer, okay? Um, for my purpose, I'll be using a dual uh, two 7,000 pound axle leaf spring suspension setup. Um, but the concepts are basically the same regardless of the trailer. Um, however, if you have only a single axle, obviously you're gonna have you're not gonna have half of the uh, components, okay? Um, but let's talk about it, okay? So first and foremost, this is something that a lot of people don't know about, and a lot of people are very, um, you know, they just don't know how important this is, okay? Um, but you have to think a leaf spring is basically just chunks of metal rubbing on one another. So anything you can do to ease that rubbing is going to prolong the life of the suspension, okay? Basically, that's what it boils down to. But first and foremost, um, on some of your leaf spring suspensions, you can see that little nipple right there. That is a grease cert, okay? Um, that is on the, on the uh, equalizer bar. And that, um, every equalizer I've seen has had them. Um, and I just shoot some squirts of Lucas Red and Tacky in there. Um, and that, that's what I do for that. That's the only grease cert on my suspension here, okay? Um, but for everything else, I use WD-40 white lithium grease. The reason why I use this is because I've had the best luck with it. Um, I think it lasts the longest. I also feel that it does the best at not picking up dirt. Um, I live on dirt roads, so whenever I haul, I have to drive many miles to get to the to get to the asphalt okay so for me anything i can do to keep mud and dirt and shit out of my suspension is always important but let's crawl under here and let's take a look at places that you want to lubricate okay so let me wiggle my fat ass under here okay so um as you can see here we have hangers you have a hanger here you, then you have your uh, equalizer that has hangers, and then up on the front you also have a hanger, okay? Um, but you have to think that this suspension is constantly doing this type of motion. So granted, you, you've got stuff that sits on bushings and stuff like that, okay? But you need to have lubrication, because if it's moving constantly like this, like this, all over the place, it needs to be lubricated or, or it, it's gonna it's gonna wear out quick. So now this is how I lubricate it. Um, and I do this periodically, probably, um, I, I don't use this trailer very much. I use my trailer with uh, torsion axles. Um, so I don't have to do any of this with torsion axles. Um, but I, I do this probably every two to four months. Uh, well, probably every one to three months. It just depends how many miles I put on this. Um, I know some guys lubricate every day on their leaf springs, weekly, monthly, whatever works for you. And it really depends how many miles you put on, okay? Um, but let's get started. So first and foremost, back here, I shoot this white lithium grease in this up in here. Don't spray there. That was pointless. Um, but that's where I shoot it. I'll even shoot some on top just so it runs down in. Okay, so that's lubricated. Okay, now I move up here to the equalizer. Like I said, on the outside, there's a grease cert. So this you kind of have to do as best you can. It's kind of a pain. Um, just get the straw. If you don't have a straw on your grease, you're going to want to get a straw. Okay, come up here. I shoot some in here. And then, okay, that's really all I reach from here. Um, and I'll do the other side from the other side, okay? Okay, come up to the front here. Don't hit your head on the trailer like I almost just did. Okay, come up here to this bushing up front. Sorry, let me get you guys squared away here, okay? shoot some in here. Now, when you do this, you want to try to get it into the bushing. If you shoot it out like this, away from the bushing, you, you, it's still going to go in. But I, ideally, if you can point it towards the bushing as best you can, that's what you're looking for. Or just be like me and shoot it past the bushing like an idiot, okay? So, there's that. Now I come up here to the other part. Up in here of the other side of the equalizer. Shoot it in there. Basically, I get very... I would rather use more than less. And then, to finish her off, I come up here and I shoot grease the best I can. 
in there and let it run down. That sums it up, guys. Thank you for watching. Um, that is how you lubricate a leaf spring suspension on a trailer. Um, like I said, this applies to any type of trailer with leaf spring axles. Um, there is some people out there that will say, oh, you should spray your leaf springs. You should spray in here, um, spray your your U-bolts, all that type of stuff. Um, I am not a believer of that. Um, I know that you can. I mean, I have done it in the past. Um, but it's just not for me because this, I mean, to be honest, the white lithium grease is expensive as it is. And really the major components that are going to wear out are any of the moving components that move all the time, especially in the uh, equalizer. That is where you are going to get the majority of your movement um, out of this suspension and the stuff that is going to wear the fastest. Now that I'm making this, I realize also shoot some up in there just for good measure. And then after I finish this, I will get my grease gun and I will shoot a couple squirts of grease into um, the outer grease cert that I showed you in the beginning of the video. So anyways, guys, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe. Um, if you have any comments or questions, don't hesitate to ask. And stay tuned for more Hotshot content. Thank you.